and the Emmanuel TV team to let our Father here know that someone does care, that Jesus Christ cares for him and we also care for him and we have a gift. This is the gift of 5,000 Naira for you sir and this is a bag of rice yeah, yeah. to take care of your welfare and your needs. So you can see the, the, the rice is here, yeah. if you can see it here, just here. Yeah. This is a bag of rice for you, okay? Yeah, yeah. As our father has made a plea to be moved to a different position, we are here to help him and we want to take care of him. So right now we want to take him out of this uh, environment into a new environment, a better environment where it is conducive for him to live and stay and enjoy his last years comfortably. So we want to invite the Emmanuel TV team forward to help our, our father here move out of this environment. But the work must go on, and it did. As soon as the Emmanuel TV team revealed their intention to move the elderly man to another place, he rejoiced. His reaction, you want to take me now? He was glad. He continued to praise the name of the Lord, saying, Hallelujah! Hallelujah! Glory be to God. Weeping may endure for a night, but joy cometh in the morning. Matthew 25 verse 45 says, Jesus Christ said, Whatsoever you do or fail to do to the least of my brethren, that you do unto me. In other words, Jesus was saying here, I have no farm or expect you to work for me, or an office or expect you to help me in checking my files. My farm and my office are your fellow brothers. Here, the Emmanuel TV team responds to this instruction, knowing that we serve God when we help our fellow brothers. They are taking the man to another room, and they lay him on a reed mat, saying he should relax while they clean up his former room. Look at the appalling squalor this aged man has been subjected to for such a long time. There's rubbish and refuse all over the place. Who knows when the room was last cleaned, but the Emmanuel TV team are cleaning the uninhabitable room right now. Okay, here is the Emmanuel TV team who are taking care of Baba's room. You can see the states it was in. There was even insects on the mattress where he has been lying for the last uh, number of years, bed bugs. And you can see the remains of the food crumb, bread crumbs on this very mattress where he has been lying, where we have just taken care of. So right now we want to totally clean the room. The team is removing the mattress now. And if you look under the bed, you can see the extents. Mm. The bed is now being taken out. You can see this room has not been cleaned for a, a very long time, a number of years. These are the items that have been found underneath. The room disinfectants is being sprayed everywhere. So right now the team is brushing the room. A room that has not been cleaned for such a long time. When we came into this room, it was totally pitch black. There was no lights. And dirt was everywhere.
So this is the amount of dirt and rubbish that was found in this room which the Emmanuel TV team are now clearing out. And viewers, if you could come into this room when we first walked in, the smell was absolutely terrible. New cobwebs are being removed. The earlier footage, one of them had gone down right to the bed which has now been removed. So this is a total and thorough renovation. See the room was full of insects and different kinds of creatures who were thriving on the dirt and dust and he was living in a world of his own with no one to help, no one to care, no hope. This is human excrements that is being picked up from the floor here, which has been lying there for such a long time with no one, no one whatsoever to take care of our father's room and look after it. So once again, viewers, this is human excrements that you are seeing right here which has been lying under this bed for a very long time. You can now see this is uh, the human urine and human excrements that has stained the wall for such a long time. With no one to help him to go to the toilet, his bed became the, the, the toilet. He has been sleeping, eating and living in this condition for an extremely long time. So right now it's being cleaned, but we are just imagine what it's like to live in such a condition. This is why it's so important to reach out and help these people. To care for those who have no one else to care for them. Because if not, such a man would surely die living in such a condition. If not for the renovation and support that the Emmanuel TV team and Prophet TV Joshua are offering. So you can see now the color of the water. It shows the amounts of human waste, human urine. He was sleeping in his own urine. As Christians, we are called to respond to all human needs. We are called to respond to all human needs. And just as the Emmanuel TV team have responded to the need of our Father here today, if you respond to the human needs in your community and let God use you, let God use you as a solution to someone in trouble. Right now the team are drying the floor that has just been washed. Here we can see a new mattress that the Emmanuel TV team have purchased. As we are relocating our father to a new environment which will be much more pleasant and comfortable for him. So you can see the new mattress is now being brought in laid on the bed. This mattress will be much more comfortable and now the bed is being laid with fresh sheets. It will be much more comfortable knowing that someone does care and his name is Jesus. Under the bed is clean as opposed to before when there was a terrible amount of human waste, human urine and other bits of food and, and dead insects that were found underneath their various implements. And now the smell that was so torrid and terrible when we entered the room has, has changed and is replaced with a clean and enjoyable smell, which is a major, major difference.